Greetings and salutations. I am Mimi Short, and this is Liberal Logic. When you say, I don't have the energy to talk about the racial violence of white people anymore, yes, all white people, when you call us a bunch of violent racists... Where did Rivery come from? Where did Rivery come from? Food banks in this country, white people amongst them, are, are privileged. They have people. more. Count, they have more, more privileges. privileges than you. I did not say that. I did a wealthy not say supermodel. That. I did not. Uh, please show me my bank account. All right. You mean we make a lot of money out of this? I tell you, don't get no respect at all. I'm saying that if a person is at the food banks and they're white and there's their counterpart and that counterpart is black, that white person has more of a chance of getting out of that situation than their black Why? counterpart. Why? Where's the evidence for that? Because of white privilege. You know, I come big old fashioned, hard working, stupid family. That's what I come from. What a dumb family I got. Looked up my family tree, I found out I'm the sap. <laughs> Really? They have white people clarify. Poor white people have a better chance in Britain of getting out of their poverty than, than poor black people. Yes. All of them. Now, shocking new Ow. figures from a range of sources have been published today, revealing the disturbing growth of a two-tier Britain. While some areas of the country are enjoying the fruits of an albeit slow economic recovery, many others are being left behind, leaving their residents jobless and in poverty. New figures from the Office for National Statistics show that almost one in every three households in Glasgow have no one in work, with a similar situation in Liverpool and the valleys of central Wales. And while jobs are being created, according to one think tank, a fifth of the British workers earn less than the living wage. <laughs> I feel like I'm up against the wall with you, Piers. No, you're not. What you're up against is somebody challenging you on your public statements. Yes. Which you've managed to turn into a massive great story of your poor victimhood. And I'm telling you, now you're sitting here, that I think when you say all white people are racially violent, mm -hmm. that is deeply offensive. But wait, there's more. We need to be speaking about what the, what the root of racism, what the root of sexism is. And sexism doesn't come from women. So of course it's caused by men. This is a social construct. You don't think women can be sexist? I don't think that women can enforce um, misogyny. What a like... load of nonsense. No, because it's all... You don't think any women can be women sexist? Women don't uphold the patriarchy, Piers. That is not uphold the Uphold the what? The patriarchy. What's that? You don't know what the patriarchy is. I do, is. but explain it. The patriarchy is basically a structure that puts men at the top of power. Mm. So... The five it's, most, it's not women five, that enforce the patriarchy. The five most women powerful, don't have anything to... Um, the five most powerful people in this country currently are women. How does that how does that sit with your patriarchies? 